How you doing? So this is gonna be um, my May favorites. I know it's kind of late in the month, but to me, it really doesn't matter um, about whenever you do it. It doesn't really matter how you do it or whatever. It's just all on you, you know, to each his own. How you do your your favorites or whatever. Um, these are things that I just use on a regular basis, and I have two new things that actually three new things that i use um faithfully and it really works and i really like it so um i'm gonna go ahead and get started um because i have quite a few things so i'm kind of doing them in a category instead of just flip-flopping everywhere um one of my favorites is i've been using this these for a while a while while like i can say for you know years or whatever um, these are the Equate Walmart brand um, exfoliating cleansing, cleansing towelettes. And it comes with 60 dual textured pre-moistured pre um, towelettes. And I like to use them for taking off my makeup, especially my eye makeup. Um, when it's, you know, that hard to get off waterproof mascara or whatever. And the reason why I like them is because... They have like this little side, I don't know if you can see it on camera, but you see it has like these little dots on it and that's like the exfoliating part. So you just put it under water and it gets like little lathery or whatever. They really don't get lathery, but they get, you know, moistened and it has like, um, is this fragrance? It has like a light fragrance, it's nothing like um, nauseating smell or whatever because, you know, sometimes you have like stuff that has that... The smell that just like oh my gosh it's too strong but I like these and these are for sensitive skin and gets my makeup right off especially on my eyes so I really like these and they're about three dollars three or four dollars for this tub right here and you don't have to go back and buy another tub that's what I like about that because they already have the refill pack so you can just go buy the refill pack and just place them back in your um thing your tub and these are your quaint exfoliating cleansing towelettes um Another thing that I've been using for a while, I have sensitive skin, so I use everything from this product. And it is the um, Cetaphil Daily Facial Cleansing Cleanser. And I use this too when I use it to take off my makeup. And it really cleanses my face really dry. And it doesn't leave like that excessive dry feeling to my face. And I use the Cetaphil um, Cleansing Moisturizer and it has SPF in it. So I'm really big on anything that has like SPF, especially if I'm putting it on my face and I go outside or whatever, especially on my lips. Um, this is really good. Um, it's a little pricey, but I think it's worth the bang for the buck. It's $7, 7 or $8 for this. And I've had this for about, about five months and it's not even like half, it's probably like halfway empty. So I just take one pump of it put it on my face, lather it up, and it gives me that clean, good feeling, you know, that fresh feeling that all my makeup off is off, and I use this um, at night, sometimes I use it in the morning to wash my face, but I mainly use it at night, and then I put my moisturizer on my face. Um, my next favorite is the Clinique Dra Dramatically Different Moisturizing Gel, and I use this a lot alone, and then, like, when I go out, I put it on I put it on and then I put like my foundation on and I'm not like a big foundation person. I only use it when I go out and put it like in my T zones and stuff. So I put it under there and it helps, you know, mattify that my skin doesn't look really oily. And this is it right here and this is $12. So they have a bigger bottle, but it comes like with the pump. So I've had this for a while and I, you know, I can you can tell that I don't wear a lot of, you know, foundation to use this a lot but I like this and it's really good and it doesn't give you like a sticky filmy like especially when it's hot outside you go outside especially if you have a moisturizer on your skin you don't have like that sticky feel on your face so this is really good also I've been using this Shishido Pureness Deep Cleansing Foam and um it's a Japanese or yeah it's a Japanese yeah it's a Japanese um product 
and their line is very good I love this my grandma uses this um, she uses the toner the foaming cleanser I know she has this cream like this moisturizer cream and it's like in this little jar and she said she paid like $70 for it but a little goes a long ways um, like I said I take a little pea size and this lathers up really good and this was $22 for this it's worth it um, I've seen a lot of improvement in my skin the clarity of it my pores my blemishes um, these right here you have these are just my moles that I have because I, my mom has them so these are like hereditary on my face and then also I have freckles so you probably see them but as far as my skin's clarity I really like it it's oil free and it's really good as far as I don't have like really shiny skin or whatever so I really like this so this is really good I got this from Ulta no I got this from Sephora and um I don't know yeah they sell it at um Ulta, having Macy's, so you know, find department stores or wherever. Um, but this is really good, and I love this stuff. Um, next for that's it for my face products as far as like cleansing my skincare. Um, next, I use this Makeup Forever Sensitive Eyes Makeup Remover, and I have really sensitive eyes. Everything about me is sensitive. My skin, everything. So I use this right here also for um, taking off my makeup, my eye makeup, and it's really good. It's like a really silky, filmy type. I take it, put it on a cotton swab, rub it on my eyes. It doesn't irritate my eyes even if a little bit gets in my eyes because it's for sensitive eyes. And this was $12. I got it from Sephora. So um, if you guys have sensitive eyes, try this because it's really good. And... Um, it doesn't have a fragrance in it, so it also gets a, a rid of that um, really stubborn, waterproof like mascara and like that hard to get off type ash. Some eyeshadows I know that I have and I've used like you'll wipe it off using a cleansing cloth and it's like still up there, the stain of it. And I'm like, ah, but this stuff right here helps really good with it. Um, next. For my like makeup wise, I like this Too Faced Shadow Insurance. I really like this. You know, it's on the expensive side, but I bought this once and I still have it. And I probably wouldn't buy it again. Just even for the price, yeah. And I have used the e.l.f. and the Jessie's Girl eye primer. And I really like those. So, you know, if you don't really want to go out there and spend a whole bunch of money. Because this is $18. So... I tried this to me I compared it with the elf and the Jessie's girl and the only thing about this this prevents your eyeshadow from creasing that's a good pro about it so but the other ones they work just as good you know everybody has their own opinion about it but this is really nice right here but like I said this is more of the expensive side for eye primer and this is $18 compared to Jessie's girl and elf when you pay $3 um, next for um, just general, um, I love this right here. This is the Sally Henson Lip Plumper Moisturizer. It has SPF in it. Of course, you know, you're going to hear me say a lot of any products that I have. I try to look for stuff that has SPF in it because, you know, as far as, you know, skin cancer and being out in the sun because, you know, the summer's coming up or whatever. Um, this is a lip plumper and it has vitamin C in it and... I got this at Walgreens and it was $2.99 and they have different flavors and this is um, tangerine so I have it on now and it has like that little glossy look to it and um, I just started using this and it makes my lips really moisturized and it has that little glow to it so I use it at nights when I go to bed so I really like this um, next is of course my all-time favorite um, I'm an NC55 with MAC and this is my studio fix right here and as you see I haven't really put a dent in it because I don't use it like that I only use it like when I go out but this is like my go-to makeup when I do go out and I really like this right here and this is I think like between 20 and 24 dollars for this next by MAC um, 
one of another all-time favorite that I like that um, came out I think not too recently but this is the studio care blend press powder and this is dark and it's like a liquid foundation a pressed powder and all in one with the primer all in it so it's kind of you know helping you where you don't have to apply all of this and I really like it because when I put it on it makes my skin feel really good like baby smooth um, it doesn't look like I have any makeup on I put it on dust it on lightly put it in my t-zones and it really hides you know my oil the oiliness in my skin and I wear it all day without having to reapply it and one of my friends she gave me a good compliment on my skin and she was like what do you have on your skin or what are you putting on your skin it's clearing up because you know when you start using products a lot and you like it and you see other people notice it too so um i told her what i was using and she um was like well, the clarity in my skin was like really pretty so i was like thanks and i told her about this and she went and got some and she loves it. She she uses it every day because she's a foundation person. But this is not like a foundation. Like, you know, you can also mix it with your um your studio fix too. Um, but I just wear this alone and it's flawless. I love it. And this is I think fourteen dollars. Don't get me um to quoting it wrong, but I will put the prices of this stuff where I got it from down in the the box below um next makeup wise is this Sonia Kushak um palette this is it right here and I love this because it has four eyeshadows a blusher uh what is this that's a primer I think that's primer a base and then it has these lippies right here, lip glosses. And I've been using the eyeshadows a lot. And I got this from Target. And this is so cute because it comes in this, like, little straw clutch. Like, you would think it's, like, a little purse or whatever. But it's kind of too thin to put anything in there. But this was $19.99. And it came with a nice little cute brush um, that it came with. And this is, like, her summer limited edition. So if you're at Target and you see this. This is it right here, and this is really cute, and I love it because it's like a go-to. I just put it in my purse, and when I want to touch up on stuff, I use this. Um, next, my one favorite is Colossal Volume by Maybelline. I love this. It gives me lots of volume to my, my eyeshadow. I mean, not my eyeshadow. To my eyes. I really love it. Um, and also, I use falsies, too. Um... I don't have any more of that, but I have to go pick up some more. But um, I really love that. But this is like my all-time go-to favorite mascara right now. So I, I really love this. I've been using this for a while, and I really, really love it. Um, my next all-time favorite for, like, makeup-wise, I, um, I keep it in the casing because I don't want it to get damaged because I... After it's sold out so many times, I take care of it. So, <laughs> but this is my all-time favorite for that you know everybody's been talking about because it's like a go-to for everyone. And it's my Naked palette. So I use this a lot. Um, my favorites are oh, Sin, Half Baked, Toasted, Hustle. And um, smog. Those are my favorite colors that I use from the Naked palette. Um, I remember at one point this was sold out. And I go online like to eBay and stuff. And people are selling them. And they're selling for like hundreds of bucks. And I'm not doing that when I could just wait to get it at Sephora for $48. So now they do have it in stock. If you guys don't have one of these, get one of these. Because it's like an everyday look for this. And last but not least, my... One of my favorites of the month is Philosophy Inner Grace. I love this. Um, it's a body emulsion. I have the shower gel and I have the body spray. And I really love this because it's like a really soft scent. Very sexy, soft scent. Um, it lingers with you. It stays with you. So, you know, that summery feeling. This is really good. Um, it's by Philosophy. 
and this was $27.20. I got it from the local PX or the uh, NEX for anybody that, you know, military or whatever, but that's where I got this from. Um, and also, last favorite is um, Max Fix Plus and Lavender. I use this alone. I had wore this the other day because it was kind of high. It was like 90 degrees outside, and I just, you know, held it against my face and sprayed it on my face to give me like that little fresh feeling. And I just like that stuff. I don't even usually wear it when I, you know, put it with my makeup or whatever. I just like to wear it alone because that's kind of what I, I buy it for. Um, also, um, another one of my favorites is this Color CoverGirl True Blend Minerals Shimmering Sands Mineral Mineral ugh, tongue tie Mineral Blush. This is my favorite right here. I really love this, and it's like a pinky, um, light pink iridescent color. And this is it right here, and it comes with this little brush, and then you lift it up, and there's the powder under there. I just went and bought me another one. I have the bronze one, and I'm like that much powder in there, maybe. But I picked this um, one up because at Walgreens it was buy one, get one 50% off, so I got me another one of these so that is my all time not all time but these are kind of things that i use all the time um the newest to my addition would be the sally hansen lip plumper um this makeup forever sensitive eyes and the shishado purifying mask so, I want to thank you guys for tuning in. If you have any comments about anything that I mentioned, comment below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. And I want to thank you guys for tuning in. You guys have a good day. Bye.